let us now understand that how do we designate uh, the letter frequent okay this is quite important from the examination point of view that the referents uh, are uh, designated as per an international standard the they are designated as r and then they are followed by a certain number okay for example r11 you have r12 you have r114 etc okay so if a refrigerant is followed by two digits after the letter r this means that the refrigerant has been derived from methane base so it has methane base okay. and if the refrigerant is followed by three digits after the letter r this means it has been derived from ethane base so you need to remember this that we are dealing with two bases first is methane next is ethane okay methane will have r and two digits after it and ethane will have r and three digits after it okay and the numbers which are assigned to hydrocarbon and halo carbon refrigerant they have a special meaning uh, the first digit on the right is, is the number of the fluorine atoms in the refrigerant the second is the number of uh, hydrogen atoms and the third is the number of carbon atoms okay now uh, in general if we speak in general the uh, chemical formula for a refrigerant whether it is a methane or a ethane base is given as this thing over here c m h n c l p f q where n p q and m follow this relation n plus p plus q is equal to 2m plus 2 okay where m is the number of m is the number of carbon atoms n is the number of hydrogen atoms cl oh sorry p is the number of chlorine atoms and q is the number of fluorine atoms okay so as we discussed above that uh, when we have a refrigerant r okay the first digit from the right hand side is q q designates the number of fluorine atoms the second digit from the right indicates the number of hydrogen atoms and the third digit from the uh, right side designates the number of carbon atoms so this is the general standard general rule by which we uh, designate a system of refrigerants that is r m minus 1 n plus 1 q m being the number of chlorine atom or sorry carbon atoms n being the number of hydrogen atoms and q being the number of fluorine atoms now let us look at an example let us look at an example uh, you have a refrigerant whose name is dichloro difluoromethane now how do you go about writing the chemical formula for this uh, this refrigerant let us see how many number of chlorine atoms do we have that is designated by letter p it says dichloro which means you have two chlorine atoms okay number of fluorine atoms it says difluoro again q becomes two okay how many hydrogen atoms do you have you have no hydrogen atoms that is zero now let us check uh, what is the value of m so n p q and m follow this rule 2 m plus 2 now let us substitute the values n is 0 q is 2 p is 2 2 m plus 2 2 and 2 get cancelled 
2 and 2 become 1 so m that is the number of carbon atoms is also 1 okay this means the chemical formula this can be written as uh, you have one one uh, carbon atom so this would become c1 okay hydrogen is 0 cl is 2 fluorine is 2 so this can be written as c cl2 f2 it's a methane base okay and the chemical formula will be r 1 minus 1 n is 0 0 plus 1 q is 2 okay so this becomes r 0 12 or simply putting it r 12 so this is how you designate a refrigerant